Hello. Ever wonder why your speaker suddenly stopped working and burn out? This is how it happens. Today we'll be diving into the common reasons behind speaker burnouts and how you can avoid from that. Reason number one. Overpowering your speakers. Pushing too much power from your amp can cause the speaker voice coils to heat up, leading to burnout. Reason number two. Weak amplifiers. Yes, weak amp can damage speaker. If you push a weak amp to its limits, it can lead to clipping. Clipping happens when the amp can clearly deliver the required power, and the audio signal gets cut off at the bus peaks. Clipped signals are square-like, which cause the voice coil to overheat, and it's receiving burst of unwanted energy and leads to burnout. Reason number 3. Poor ventilation in the speaker driver system. High quality woofers use better ventilation for the voice coil. Large voice coils can handle more power and accumulate more heat during bus peaks. These are the three main reasons speaker burnouts. There may be other reasons, but these are the most common ones I know. To answer the main question how to avoid burning your speakers, the solution is simple. Use your ears. When you hear clipping or distorted sound coming from the speakers, you know you've reached the system limit and need to turn the volume a bit down to save your speaker woofers. Never use low frequencies for small speakers, because lower frequencies require more energy. Since it's a small speaker, it likely has a small voice coil that heats up very quickly and can burn out in seconds. Now I show two cases. In one case I use frequencies designed for this speaker. In the second video I use very low bass frequencies that were not suitable for it. Now you can see how little time it takes to burn out a speaker with low bass frequencies. Any speaker can handle its own maximum power for a short time, but once the voice coil heats up, it will start to burn, and the speaker will produce a crickling sound and the speaker is dead. I hope you learned something new in this video. I am open to discussion and would love to hear your experience with speaker burnout. Feel free to post a comment under this video. But for now, good luck with your loudspeakers.